Most of the time, when you sign up for a new email newsletter, you receive a message in your inbox right away asking you to confirm that yes, you do want to receive these emails at this email address. Now, in addition to making sure that your newsletter lists don't get filled with spammy email addresses, uh, these also protect users so that no one signs them up for a newsletter without their permission. I know, you worked hard to get that user to agree to receive your emails in their inbox. You don't want to make them go through yet one more step. But this is important for a few reasons. A lot of newsletter management programs charge per user once you've reached a certain threshold or start charging more per user after you've reached a certain threshold. So you certainly don't want to add and pay for users to be added to your list if they have no intention of reading your emails. Furthermore, having a bunch of garbage emails can result in a high abuse rate. Getting your emails marked as spam or not receiving the recipients who really do want to get your emails altogether because your ISP could get blacklisted. So let's make that hoop a little bit more fun to jump through. I'm gonna show you how to edit that confirmation email. Since MailChimp is used by so many of our customers, I'll be using their platform as an example. So here we are in the MailChimp editor. Now, in order to edit this, you wanna go over to your audience tab. Then you wanna go over to manage audience and select sign up forms. This is where it can get a little bit confusing because you want to go to the form builder and select the confirmation thank you page. So in this case we're not actually sending someone to a thank you page but we are editing the opt-in email. It gets edited from the same place. So over here is where you could put in a URL to redirect them to a thank you page and then just below it we can edit the email that a person will receive in their inbox after submitting their email address. So in here you can add your logo, you can edit the message, you can give someone a thank you, coupon code, a special article or video or some other bonus to thank them for subscribing, and you want a big call to action to tell them to confirm that yes, I do want to receive your newsletters, and then you're on your way.